Hello everybody and welcome to another episode of the Buffalo State College Bengals Dynasty on NCAA Football 14. Please make sure you drop a like on this video, show your support for this great series so that it can continue with the support it deserves. I thank you guys for watching last week's episode. If you didn't, that will be in a card above, but Miami of Ohio came in and destroyed us with their rushing attack 35 to 18. This week, we'll be taking on our in-state rival and in-city rival, the Buffalo Bulls. They have a tough squad led by quarterback Tyree Jackson, who is an absolute unit to deal with. I can't wait to see how this game goes. Let's head down to the field for Legion and the call. Legion. A big one for the Bengals' third game and MAC conference play. The Buff Cup is underway. Anthony Johnson back to return the kick at his own end zone. Takes it out to the 10, to the 20. Weaves inside, gets to about the 30 and is dropped there. And that brings out Tyree Jackson, Anthony Johnson, and the Buffalo offense. The Bulls are pretty electric. They'll be tough to stop, but they are 3-3 three and three and a better team on paper than the Bengals. The first gave us to Emmanuel Reed. He spins off a tackle and picks up about five. Sets up second down and five. Tyree Jackson works out of the shotgun to the left side. Delayed give Reed and Marshawn Colliver drags him down. A loss of just about one and a half and it sets out third down and seven. A chance to get off the field for the Bengals. Tight end comes in motion from left to right. Tyree takes the snap all day in the pocket. Fires and dumps it off quick outside and Reed makes the catch and they give him the first down. Are you kidding me? That looked like it was short anyways. First down for the Bulls. First down and 10 from the left hash. Jackson fires out route outside. Mabry makes the catch and he's drug out of bounds at about the 40 yard line into Buffalo State Bengal territory. A gain of 20 and out of bounds on the right sideline. Jackson goes empty three by two. Draws back, four man rush comes. Pressure gets there and he has to throw it away on third down. BSC bends, certainly doesn't break and the Bulls settle for three. Tayshawn Prince goes bunch to the right side. Draws back, quick throw and he missed him. He had Ben Bush over the middle and just over fired. And the Bengals have to give it right back. Second and five for the Bulls. Jackson trips to the left side, takes the snap, fires to the left side. Reed makes the catch, has the first down, and he lost his balance, but he's inside the 30. Next play, they go trips to the right side. Jackson with Reed in the backfield. Play action, throws the bubble screen. Scott the third, makes the catch. Powers forward for the first down, out to the 15. Jackson has a cannon, doesn't need to use it there. One play later, second down and five. Reed gets the carry, navigates the hole to the left side, breaks a tackle from Shoemaker, breaks another and has about four on the carry. Sets up third down and one for Tyree who goes gun. He keeps it himself. Tyree pulls it down and Todd Tremblay comes in to deny him at the goal line, but he has first down and goal for Buffalo. Jackson gives Reed, touchdown Buffalo. They go up 10 to nothing early on in the game. There's a minute 48 left in the first quarter, and Buffalo can't be stopped. Prince goes bunch to the right side. He fires over the middle, caught Hunter Haskins. He has a gain of about six. Clock continues to tick down under a minute in the quarter. Prince takes a third down snap, gives Banks, and he did not get there. Only a gain of two. Fourth down and one. They need to punt it away. Derek Rain, see if he can pin them back deep. A high booming kick takes a bounce inside the 40. Johnson retrieves it after the hop that went in Buffalo State's favor and gains about 10. That might have been one of the best punts from Rain all season. Strong Eye gives to Reed. He cuts back to the left side, spins off a tackler, and has a gain of about six. Clock continues to wind down all the way to the end of the first quarter. Buffalo leads 10-0 over Buffalo State. They need to get some offense going early in this one. Mac conference action resumes. Weak eye formation on third down and two. Jackson gives to Emmanuel Reed. He cuts to the left side. Breaks a tackle from Littlefield. And has a first down and a gain of 15. He has eight carries for 36 yards and a touchdown. That certainly helps his average. First down and 10. They go trips to the right side. Reed in the backfield to the right side. Jackson gives to Reed. And he's dropped after a gain of seven nonetheless. The Bulls continue to drive, looking for a three-possession lead. Jackson, speed option left side, keeps it himself, spins off a tackler, and has a first down and a gain of four. Looked like Simon Stevens couldn't bring him down. It's third down and five. They work two by two. Jackson stands in the pocket, has to roll to his left, and he gets sacked. Dante Dominguez 
Able to bring him down as he tried to roll to his left. They tack on a field goal. Remains a two-possession lead. Prince fires. Bush, first down over the middle. He has 18. An excellent connection from Prince to Bush. A connection that's come on fire the last couple weeks as Prince goes back his way. And this time he drops it on third down and nine. That was a chance to get into field goal range for the first time today. And Bush just can't hang on. Buffalo State has to punt it back to Buffalo, who already has a 13-0 lead. Jackson fires to the corner and has Anthony Johnson for 12 and a first. A big time play for the star wide receiver. First down and 10, I formation, tight end to the right side. Jackson gives to Reed to the right and he's wrapped up. Todd Tremblay on the edge says, no, thank you. Draws him behind the line of scrimmage. Loss of one. One play later, it's third down and 11. Jackson has trips to the right side. He fires to Johnson over the middle and he has a first down. Oliver Rover spins him down, but he has 14. Another fresh set of downs for Buffalo. Tight end comes in motion left to right. The give is to Reed. He puts his head down and he picks up seven yards on the carry. Tough running from Reed as the clock is under two minutes and ticking. Make it about a minute and a half. Tyree Jackson steps back. Blitz comes. He has to step up and run. He breaks two tackles. Stays on his feet and picks up the first down. Buffalo State can't catch a break. Another fresh set of downs. They have a single back set. Wide receiver in the slot to the right. Jackson, quick throw, out route Mabry. He stiff arms a man and picks up another first down and a gain of 11. The Bulls use a timeout. It's first down yet again. They have trips to the left side. Jackson, give inside to Reed and Wendell Wallace is there. Holds him to five and they use their second timeout. Second down and five. Jackson draws back. Same formation. Steps up to run. He has a big hole in front of him. And a touchdown for Buffalo as they go up 20 to nothing in the first half of play. Buffalo State starting to get desperate. They need a big possession with 110 left in the half. Lee takes it out. Cuts to the left side. He has a big hole in front of him. Lee to the 42-yard line in a gain of 39. First down and 10 with 58 seconds. Prince fires quickly, caught Hunter Haskins. He has 15, and that was a dangerous throw. Just able to fit it in there. Buffalo State has 15 and a first down. They use a timeout, 35 seconds, first down. Prince dumps it off for Lynch. Lynch has a lot of green in front of him. He spins and is able to get down and out of bounds. They pick up the first and have a first down. Wing offset, Banks. Get from right to left side. He has a big hole in front of him and picks up about seven. Just trying to get closer as they use a timeout. Third down and three. They go empty. Two by three. Prince, quick throw. And Moss can't hang on. The sure-handed receiver drops it. And they have to settle for three going into the half. A big missed opportunity. They're down three to 20. I think it's safe to say that that is not what Buffalo State wanted to present in the first half to their inner city rival. Absolutely no fear in their hearts as Emmanuel Reed, Tyree Jackson, and Anthony Johnson, they just had no answer for them overall. We will have to see how things go in the second half as BSC does start out with the football. Prince goes play action, floats one for Simmons, and he makes the catch. Another tight window throw, and that's the type of play you want to see all half long. Buffalo State receivers really struggled to get open last half, and when they did, they dropped the ball most of the time. First down and 10, they go wing offset. Give to Banks right up the middle, and he has nearly enough for another first down. They keep it moving. Banks sweep right side, and he picks it up this time in a gain of four. They need to lean on Banks. The passing game is not working. Prince gives back to Banks between the left guard and the center, and he has 11 and a first down. Not nearly enough opportunities in the first half of play. On second 11, they go back his way. Banks right at the middle, gets a block and touchdown from 23 yards out. And that is exactly what Buffalo State needed. They cut this back to a two possession game and have scored 10 unanswered points. Jackson and co get it back. The delayed give to Reed and Littlefield doesn't let him go anywhere. Drop for a loss of two. It's third down and 12. Can Buffalo State get off the field? Jackson, four-man rush, steps up to throw, fires deep. Johnson, no! He can't hang on, and I think Danny Dripper, of all people, got a hand on it, and they're lucky he did. 
It's first down and 10 for Buffalo State. Wing offset give to Banks yet again. Why not? Gain six. Has a bit of a hole before the defensive tackle drags him down. They go gun this time. Give right back to Banks. He jukes to the left side inside and has a first down. That moves the chains for Buffalo State to the gun. Prince play action. Watch out. He gets hammered in the backfield. Drop for eight. Justin Brandon got there. Prince on second and 18. Motions banks out wide. Fires Haskins. Quick throw to the left side. He makes the catch. Nearly enough for a first. It's third and four. Prince fires and Lee can't hang on. It was a little bit behind him, but you have to make that play. They have to punt it back. Jackson back to work. He steps up. Runs into Dante Randall, and he goes down for a loss of 10. Randall has undoubtedly been the team's best defensive player so far, and it's no surprise as he leads the team in sacks. Make it third down in 23. Jackson from his own end zone lobs it outside to Scott, and he makes the catch for 12, but not nearly enough. They have to punt it back to DJ Lee, who waits the return. At the Buffalo logo, takes it, cuts to the left side, looks for room on the outside, to the 40 and inside the 35. This will help, 21 yards on the return. First down and 10 for Buffalo State in the offense. Banks sweeps to the right side, plenty of room in front of him and he gains 20 out to the 15. That is the best start to the drive that you could ask for. He's already out to 98 yards on the game. It's only the third quarter. Prince drops back to throw first down and 10. Steps up, finds Watsky, and he has a reception inside the 10. Third down and two. The wing offset give to Banks. Banks finds a hole up the middle, and he's in for the touchdown. 17 unanswered for Buffalo State. Where is this coming from? Banks does it again with his second touchdown of the game, second of the half. Jackson drops back, dumps it off for Mabry. To the outside, can't get to the sticks, but he has eight nonetheless. Second and two, Jackson, quads left, steps up to run. He can escape and he does just that. Jackson tripped up and hit and the ball comes free. Dante Randall recovers and Todd Tremblay was there to knock it away. That was what Buffalo State needed as Buffalo was driving and Todd Tremblay comes in to deliver the heads up hit. Jackson can't hang on, and Buffalo State, once down 0-20, has a chance to take the lead in the third quarter. Dumps it off for Lee, races to the corner and picks up the first down, and that rightfully ends the third quarter. As hold your horses, we've got a ball game in Buffalo. We are back, first down and 10, Buffalo State driving to the 45. Prince fires quick to Moss, and he makes the catch in traffic for 11. That moves the chains, and they go wing offset. Banks takes the carry up the middle and has maybe five yards, and they officially rule it second and four. Bunch to the right side out of the gun. Prince, snap, fires to Moss, and he has a first down and a gain of five over the middle. Wing off set yet again. Waski comes in motion. The give is to Banks yet again, and why not as he gains six, and he's over 100. Second down and four. Wing off set yet again. Banks big hole up the middle. He jukes to the right side and has a first down out to the 14 yard line. Jeremiah Banks to 132. And he has a nice move to put them inside the red zone. Shotgun set. Prince keeps it himself. Spins, breaks a tackle and dives into the end zone. Buffalo State has taken the lead. Can you believe it? They're up 24 to 20. And Buffalo suddenly the underdog. 24 unanswered points. Tyree Jackson works to the right side and has a gain of about seven out to the 50. They may not be done with 420 left. Reed sweeps to the left side. He has the corner and gains about five on the carry. It's amazing to see how much this Buffalo offense is stalled in the second half. Jackson trips to the left side, takes a snap, escapes to his right side, gets around Littlefield, and he has a first down and slides down to the 35. Clutch play for Tyree Jackson. Two plays later, it's third and two. Jackson gives to Reed. He cuts to the left side, breaks a tackle from Springs, and has a first down to the 20. Buffalo back inside the red zone. Jackson drops back, fires. Scott makes the catch, and he is drugged down. But inside the five yard line, it's first down and goal. They go single back. They give to Hawkins up the middle and he gains three. Doesn't break the plane. 
They'll try again. Two by two bunch out of the gun. Jackson drops back to throw. Steps right to run and he has a clear field in front of him and a touchdown. Buffalo regains the lead and breaks a 24 point scoring drought. They ate the clock down to 151 and Buffalo State has a chance to take the last possession of the game. 141 and working. Prince it's now or never fires for Watsky. It's incomplete. Third down and 10. This could be the biggest play of the game. Prince fires and it's caught in traffic. DJ Lee. He actually held on to one. And Buffalo State set up with first and 10. Prince fires outside. Ben Bush makes the catch. Nine yards and out of bounds. 123 and working. Tayshawn, screen, banks. He gets away and gets the first down. 12 yards and they're near the red zone yet again. First down and 10, they have a bunch to the left side. Prince fires, caught Watsky. He gains eight yards and the clock continues to wind down to 46. Third and two, they give up the middle. Banks with a move and he has a first down to about the nine yard line. They eat the clock, second and goal from the six yard line. Gives to Banks up the middle and he dives in the end zone for a touchdown. That is the third lead change in about the last four minutes of game time and Buffalo State takes the lead 31 to 27. Buffalo has 23 seconds. Tyree Jackson goes empty, two by three. Pressure comes, dumps it off for Johnson, and they have to use their first timeout as he gains eight. 18 seconds for Buffalo, third down and two. Receiver comes in motion from the outside. Jackson, third down and two, takes the snap, fires corner. Johnson makes the catch inside the 40. They use a timeout, but they need a touchdown. 12 seconds. It's first down and 10. Jackson back to the air to the sideline, and it's caught again. George rushing to the sideline. They have eight seconds. It's first and 10, one timeout. Jackson rolls right to run inside the five and slides with two seconds left. This play is for the game. First down and goal. Two seconds left. Jackson, delayed give, read, and he didn't get there. Dante Randall drags him down, and it's over. Buffalo State, from down 20 points, has won the game. Unbelievable finish. And thank Dante Randall for helping them get their second win of the year. Final score from Buffalo, 31 27 Buffalo State wins back to FG see you next week Wow what an exhilarating game with a last second goal line stand by Dante Randall unbelievable what a second half played by this team you gotta love the fight that they show game in and game out Jeremiah Banks is a freaking superstar, 152 yards, three touchdowns for him. He played like a man on fire. You love to see what he was able to bring to the table. Tremblay with his 13 tackles. Seems like he was always making a big tackle to prevent a bunch of yardage moving forward. This series is getting better and better, guys, and I hope you're enjoying it. If you are, please make sure you that you hit that like button. Take a look at the progression of the team so far. Just getting a win against Buffalo on the road was huge, but we have another test in MAC conference play as we will be taking on the Central Michigan Chippewas, and Tommy Lazaro can run the football. Guy's got some speed, and he can throw a little bit, so he can be pretty dangerous against us, and we'll have to see how we're going to want to play him next week. Let us th know what you think in the comments section below. I thank you guys so much for watching this dual series series franchise gaming and legion making a fire series for you make sure that you join the squad and we can build a winner together take care Build you,